Hi, Brian T. Yes. Dixie Jean here. We're here at Bad B9 at Commerce Casino. I heard there's a little bit of traffic getting over here. Yes. I mean, it's Los Angeles, so you're going to get that. You, you should be, I should be used to it by now, but you, you never get used to traffic. So it seems like, you know, you're a busy guy. You've centered out of here. You're doing, you did Wolverine that's coming out. Yeah. And yeah. Uh, uh, Fast and Furious Tokyo Drift. Mm -hmm. You know, what are you what are you looking forward to with uh, Wolverine coming out? Well, I think everything with Wolverine. I yeah. think uh, the fans are going to be pleasantly surprised to see what this Wolverine has to offer. I mean, James Mangold really took it to another level, brought so much cap like depth and character to the to the whole entire series. And I think fans are just going to go ballistic when they see it. Definitely, we're really excited. So it's it's out July 26. You can check it out. Now going into comics, is Wolverine your favorite comic? Totally. Completely? By by far, I'm like a fanboy geek myself. Ever since I was a little kid? Ever since I was a little kid, I was about like starting from my my eight years oldness and then about three years in a row. Okay. Halloween, Wolverine, Edmanium Claws with like cardboard cutout and aluminum foil. Did you ever try to use them on anyone? Oh totally. You're eight years old. What are you gonna do? You're gonna try gonna to like try you're gonna you're gonna have to. I think I, I actually had those things when I was a little kid, but I try to open like soda bottle caps. With a many plus. Like, yeah, I was just, yeah, I was trying to be a challenge. I that's, wasn't trying to do it. That's pretty good. That's so it's pretty good. To do. You might have had a, like a good set of hair. Mine were only like the ones that like mom could put together and help mm. me put on my hands. No, no, no. Wolverine was my favorite guy. X Men was my favorite character. And so then now be a, being a part of it, it's probably a dream been a true. dream come true. Yeah. Total dream come true. I mean, I was such like the little fanboy kid on set. Kind of running around like. Oh, You're like, can I get your autograph? Yeah, <laughs> <Is that> you? <laughs> totally. I am not a big autograph guy, but yeah, I'm definitely. Just a to be able big to have conversation kid. with him. Yeah, and it's great. And Hugh Jackman's one of the sweetest, nicest men. I heard he's a very and humble man. Totally, totally, totally. He deserves all his accolades and. Now being here. It's a lot different being at a live MMA fight compared totally. to seeing it on TV. Is this your first? This is live my fight? first. This is my first live fight. I mean, I, I've seen a, a ton of MMA fights on television, and as a live fight, I'm really, really excited to see what what kind of energy it has. Because I'm yes. assuming there's so much like just kind of kinetic feel, especially being right next to the ring and stuff. So it's I a am, complete variety too, because yeah. you never know what's going to happen. Sometimes the fights go the, the all three rounds, and you can just tell they're they're trying so hard, right. they're struggling. And then there's this one, it's just like a simple knockout, and you don't see it coming. It's just totally. it keeps you kind of on the edge of your seat. No, that's what I'm excited life. about. That's what I, I mean. I'm a, I'm a hockey fan, but I think watching it live and on television is, mm -hmm. is a completely different experience. And to actually go there live is, is so amazing. So to come here and not have it on television, I'm psyched for it, for sure. And it's kind of in your backyard. It's probably not that bad coming just No, not at all. Know. Come down to Commerce, watch some amazing athletes kind of beat themselves up. You know, what more can I ask for? Is it something that you would want to do yourself? Oh, can no. you see you doing that? No, 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 no. I'm a lover, not a fighter. Definitely oh, okay. not. No, I. I I, I give nothing but respect to these guys and the yes. way that they train and I know, you know, the, the discipline that they must have to to really go through everything to get to this level. Is, it's a lot of sacrifice for them as well. It's, uh, it's, it's, a, it's unbelievable. not an easy sport to maintain because totally. of all the sacrifices they have to make. So Absolutely. I respect them as much as for totally. that too. I've got nothing but respect for them. And then is there anyone on this card that you know of that you going to see fight tonight? I'm actually, uh, I, I was just coming from Fox, kind of coming over here and stuff, and you know, we've been planning to come here. I haven't been able to kind of look at the card, but I'm actually interested to see anybody, really. Well, we, we have some uh, good fights, uh, a couple of retirement fights. Uh, Gabe Rudiger's fight is going to okay. be uh, his retirement fight, and it's also kind of interesting because the, the opponent he's going against, Scott Catlin, right. they've fought each other before. Okay. Scott Catlin beat him, so... Dave Rudiger is kind of going for redemption. For right, time. and kind of like go out, kind of go on on in a swan yes. song, kind of go out and bang and stuff like that too. That's interesting. And then interesting. we have a title fight going on tonight for right, belts. I heard uh, that. George Valdez versus uh, Ernest Chavez. Right. So that one's going to be tough. Uh, and then the Chris Foley fight, that one's going to be pretty intense. Like yeah. It, there's a lot to look forward to tonight. I'm um, telling you, I am so pumped for it. Definitely. Well, I'm happy I'm, that you came for your first live my MMA first fight live MMA USA. fight, and I like I want to see them all. I, I sincerely do because uh, I know whatever's happening in that ring, I can't do. Mm -hmm. So I, I I still like got nothing but respect for them. Definitely. All right. Well, we'll get you in there so you can get out there. Hopefully, uh, we hear you screaming for those fighters. Absolutely. Uh, it's pretty intense. So you can expect certain things when you go into there. One. 
there's either the fighters that are filling out the other opponent or they're the okay. ones that just go right into just go it. Right those into are it. the really highly intense ones. So. Nice. I'll look out right. for We'll that, let you get sure. inside. Thank you for talking with us Thank and best you. of luck with the coming out of Wolverine. Thank you so much. I appreciate All it. All right, and hopefully good things to go from there. Definitely.